Good afternoon. It is Sunday, the 3rd of November 2019. It is almost getting to the end of the year. How exciting. And it is half past two in the afternoon. I didn't go to church today because I am not too strong. However, I'm going to be making myself some very delicious Nigerian stew made with mixed meat and fried mackerel fish. And by the way, my name is Olua Kemi as usual. Um, and I've got my ingredients laid out. And here I've got uh, the main ingredients for the stew, which is tomatoes, onions, pepper, and tatashi. In here I've got uh, uh, six, um, six 400 grams teens of plum tomatoes, three tatashi, that three lamb peppers, and seven hot bonnet peppers with two medium-sized onion bulbs blended and boiled in this bowl. And here I've got two micro fishes, but um, uh, I oh, prepared fresh from fresh. I cleaned out my micro, removed the guts and cut them into the sizes and then placed them in a seasoned water. A season, I seasoned the water with salt and bullion powder and then put the micro in to season for about um, 30 to 45 minutes and then brought out to drain and then air fried it that is I fried it in an air fryer um, and that's why it looks like that and in this bowl I've got mixed meat I've got shaki I've got uh, goat meat and I've got chicken in this bowl again as you can see it's I just brought it up from the freezer I usually buy my uh, protein in bulk clean uh, season per boy and store in the fridge and bring out portion by portion as when and I need them and in this I'm going to be using um, onions as, I'm sorry salt to taste and obviously uh, sunflower oil to start to cook my stew and I'll be using six cubes of um, Maggi Ni Maggi Niger pot I love this Maggi my sister-in-law brought it from Nigeria for me and it's very very nice tasty so it's called Maggi Niger pot. I'm going to be using six cubes of that. I'm using six cubes at least to start with because of the um, quantity of tomato plum I've got in here. I've got also in this bowl chopped onions, one medium sized chopped onions, all of onions, yes. And, and that, that I'm going to use that. I pour that first of all in my hot palm, uh, sunflower oil before I pour the stew. Then let's get cooking now. My pan is hot. I'm going to pour in my some. Um, sunflower oil. In here I've got my sunflower oil. Um, I've got at least about one cup of uh, uh, half a cup, I'm not sure. Of one for some, I just pour it and when it, when I think it's okay, I remove it if, I, if I'm not in the mood of measuring. Anyway, I've got some flour oil in there and I'm going to allow it to heat up for a couple of minutes before I pour in my chopped onions. My oil has been heating up for about two minutes now. I'm now going to pour in my chopped onions. I'll be allowing this to saute for a couple of minutes. My onions and my onions is currently sauteing in the hot oil. Now I'm now going to pour in the mixture of blended and parboiled plum tomatoes, cut pepper, tatashi and onions. I'll be covering this and allow it to simmer together to bring to the boil. And for a couple of, um, for about three to five minutes, it doesn't need to cook that much more because the pepper is already put on. All right. This stew has been boiling for, I mean, cooking for about three minutes. I'm now going to add the mixed meat. I'm not going to add the fish yet. Um, the fish is going to be the last item I add into this stew. I put in this stew because I don't want, although it's fried, but 
I still want to be careful so it doesn't break too much in this tube. I'm not going to add the six cubes of Maggi Niger pot. Add about one tablespoon of salt. This is roughly one tablespoon of salt. Add about half a cup of water. I'm going to now cover and allow it to boil and simmer for about 10-15 minutes to allow everything to come together and after which I will check for taste and then add the remaining ingredient which is the fried fish my stew has been sizzling for some minutes now at least 10 minutes it's looking nice I've checked for taste it tastes yummy Although I had to add about one teaspoon full of um, bouillon powder to bring out the taste again together. I'm now going to add my fried fish, my air fried mackerel fish. I'm doing my air fried mackerel fish one after the other, other gently. Gently, gently, gently. Don't want it to break. Careful for it not to break. Yeah, that 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 head of fish, it's completely. I've removed every removables from there, so it's it's the way I like it, so that I can eat it freely. Right. That's my. Now it's gonna see. Um, turn it, turn together gently. Whoops. It's yummy. And then allow it to simmer for about five minutes and my stew is done. Hello again. My stew is done. This is my mixed meat and fried air fried mackerel fish stew. My Niger pot stew. Thank you for watching. I'm going to serve mine today with rice. That's matter rice. And you can serve yours with okra soup and pounded yam or pepper or amala or you can serve yours with vegetable soup spinach or some people will eat bread with it anyway i'm eating rice with my tonight or this afternoon anyways thank you for watching have a wonderful uh, week ahead and if you like what i've done anything i've done in this video please comment like share and subscribe and I would appreciate your constructive criticism, I mean, your constructive um, feedback. Please do not leave any negative, downgrading or condescending comments. I would really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye and God bless.